every day. Like, what's our anchors today? Hello, Sycamore Junior High. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy Hello Sycamore Junior High, today is Tuesday, May 17th, 2022, and here we have another full episode of our daily video announcements. I'm Hanin. Hello all, happy Tuesday, and we're down to 13 days of school remaining. I'm Ava, and I was all please stand and place our right hand over heart to say the Pledge of Allegiance together. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, Thank you, and please be seated. We've got a lot more great news today. First, we have a message from the high school dance team. Hi, I'm Elise Williams, and I will be one of the coaches for this year's dance team. So about myself, I was on the dance team when I was in high school. I graduated from Sycamore in 2002, and I coached while I was on the University of Cincinnati dance team. heart and soul. I will be coaching alongside my friend and former dancer, Gabby Davis. Hi everyone, I'm Gabby Davis. Um, I am one of the dance team coaches for the upcoming school year. My passion has always been for dancing. Sophomore and junior and senior year, those three years, I had Coach Elise. I do know her coaching skills because she coached me and they are amazing. So me and her are really excited to coach you girls the way that we think is going to be so good for you guys and we are really excited to do this together. We have high expectations for this year. We're looking for dancers who are hardworking and who want to be a part of the spirit community at Sycamore High School. Sycamore Varsity Flyerettes has a long history and it is recognized as a varsity sport. So we plan on running it with that level of showmanship. Check out the video on Google Classroom. Do your best to learn those moves and give us some pizzazz and upload by Sunday, May 29th. I'm excited to be back. Yes, eighth graders, if you're interested in joining the high school dance team, there's a mandatory informational meeting Tuesday 24th at 7 p.m. Check your email and you can get more information from the QR code or the Google Classroom code CMQBUHI. Okay, what national day do we have today? Today is National Graduation Tassel Day. Across the country, May 17th marks the annual parade of academic achievement in the National Graduation Tassel Day. The day celebrates the accomplishments of every graduate. Each year, auditoriums and stadiums fill with proud families and friends, excited to witness the commencement ceremonies of high schools, colleges, and universities. Tassels dangle from the mortar boards in the colors of their esteemed institutions. With each gown crisply pressed, graduates and families prepare for the big day. High school and undergraduate students start with their tassels on the right and move the tassels to the left upon graduation. For those earning graduate degrees and higher, the tassels start on the left and move to the right upon completion of their higher level degrees. These traditions of moving, of moving the tassel have only recently gained popularity in the last 50 years. Now for the fact of the day. Did you know that there are about 900 million dogs on Earth? Today's daily survey. We did not have any results to share today, but make sure to check out today's daily survey on Google Classroom. <whistles> Next up, birthdays. Hanin and I have started a new segment along with our normal Sycamore Junior High birthdays where we give a list of today's celeb celebrity birthdays. This occurs every Tuesday and Thursday. Happy birthday to Jonathan C. We hope you have a wonderful day to celebrate. Now over to our celebrity birthdays. Happy birthday to Bob Saget, who is a famous TV star and comedian, Matt Ryan, who is a quarterback for the Indianapolis Colts, and Jordan Knight, who is most commonly known for being in the boy band New Kids on the Block. Phew, that's a, that's a ton. But now over to our wonderful and magnificent Mr. Harris. 
Good afternoon, Sycamore Junior High, and welcome to your video announcements. No, this is not a grand jury up here. These are some of the representatives from our fine orchestra and band programs here at the Junior High, and they won some awards over the weekend, so let's get to it. All right, first, congratulations to the 7th and 8th grade bands for their orchestra, and orchestras, excuse me, for their performances at the Music in the Parks competition at Kings Island and Cedar Point. The 7th grade band received a superior rating and a second place in their division, while the 8th grade band received a superior rating and first place in their division so who are my band people give a little wave okay little, little props out there good job all right the seventh grade orchestra received a rating of excellent in first place in their division and the eighth grade orchestra received a rating of superior in first place in their division furthermore they received the esprit de corps award which is given to one performing ensemble for their professionalism and that's an awesome award for that so who represents the orchestra groups up in here give yourselves a waves because you on film immortalize congratulations to these outstanding junior high instrumental musicians good job guys all right get out all right <laughs> Thank you guys. Congratulations. That's pretty awesome stuff. All right, doing Flex Bell on Thursday, May 29th, or May 19th. That's this Thursday, May 19th. There will be a meeting in the cafeteria for all seventh graders interested in running cross country in the fall. So remember, Thursday, seventh graders interested in running cross country, run to the cafeteria during Flex for this informational meeting. That's it. I'm out. Enjoy the day. See you tomorrow. Okay, what's for lunch today? For lunch, we'll have spaghetti and meatballs. We also serve chicken patties. Now for the joke of the day. What was kite? What was the kite's favorite instrument? I don't know. The strings. <laughs> <laughs> Go, Go waves. waves.